another fine day, another very beautiful day, another day for we to get together and have conversations that can help us grow. Another day for we to get together and have conversations we uh, it bless not just uh, our body but our soul. Um, to really, it's it, 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 uh, it, it's on another level. Uh, the people we receive, the people we talk to, uh, the people who take part in our conversations, uh, the people who are pushing to make sure uh, the project gets to where it's supposed to be. Uh, it's just wonderful. It's a blessing. Uh, I, I'm very, very happy I'm part of this project. I'm very, very happy I'm, I'm part of uh, the group of people we don't decide to go change our community. The group of people we don't decide to they will impact our community positively. The group of people we don't decide to do put in their effort, they'll do everything possible for make sure see, we push with what we would, we, we would want to do. And so even if we don't achieve them, we feel at least lay the groundwork, we feel at least lay the foundation uh, for our kids to come on later and do something really, really beautiful. Today, uh, we'll get some person on the show. <laughs> So much respect for him, so much uh, admiration for him. Um, his simplicity, his humility, his work. Um, he has done a lot. He has done a lot as per me, though. And uh, that's the reason why we want to have him on to him on Toridi. That's the reason why uh, we want to have him on Toridi. So, um, yeah, uh, we have a few people watching already. Please go ahead and share. Uh, like I was saying earlier today, we we're going to talk for some person, someone who has done a lot for our community. Is uh, uh, has done a lot for our community. Is is doing a lot for our community. Um, one thing our community don't learn for start doing, I give people their roses when they can still smell them. At first, it was not like that. It was difficult it was it was hard for you to see our community celebrating someone uh for the wonderful things they 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 have done uh but now it's different now it's different we we have a community where people acknowledge people for the greatness for their greatness uh people acknowledge people for uh their vision people acknowledge people for for, for, for whatever beautiful thing uh we see them doing and that is what we want to do today we want to celebrate someone. We want to celebrate a brother. We want to. We want to talk to a brother. We want to um, understand how he thinks. Uh, he, he has done a lot. Like I keep telling you guys, uh, he has done a lot. Uh, guys, let us go ahead and share the video. I want us to at least have a few. I, I want us to have a good number before he joins. By the way, the song will go on for background. Uh, that is um, uh, our sister Renyo feature interno. A wonderful piece, a wonderful song, wonderful music. Um, hi, B, how you doing? Uh, guys, go ahead and share the video. Go ahead and share the video. Go ahead and share the video. Uh, share it to your friends. Share it to your family. Um, we need to have these conversations. We we want people to join so they can ask their questions directly. 
uh, people did complain say the last time and not actually give chance for for the guests to answer their questions. I apologize for that. We could make sure see ooh, this time around we'll do them better. We'll do them differently. Um. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, uh, sorry, I struggle for share the video. So we'll get people join the live and then we we'll kick start the session. Uh, one thing is sure, it's going to be a beautiful one. I've known Apule Jeffrey also for a very, very long while. Uh, not as a friend, uh, but more as a, a celebrity, more as someone who is doing something for our community, someone who decides to stand out, someone who decides to be unique, someone who decides, you know what, I, I I will do everything to make sure our community know that, okay, uh, whatever any other person is doing, wherever they are, we can also, as a community, produce that and not only produce that, but do better than that. So that is exactly what we are trying, uh, that is exactly what we are trying to do. That is exactly what we are trying uh, we're trying to do. Uh, make sure we celebrate these guys now that hey, 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 my brother, my brother, my brother. <laughs> my brother, my brother, make sure you stay on this live till the end, please, because I want to invite you uh, so we can have uh, this conversation together. Yeah, like I was saying, would they put that place now we um, we don't understand how we things they work. It's not like in the past where we were just clueless. We we never knew it to happen. Uh, now we don't realize say, hey, we can actually achieve a lot just on our own. We don't realize say, we can actually do more or much uh, just by ourselves. Uh, the people that will be used to feel say we really need them. I don't really think we need them anymore. Not like we don't need them, but we don't realize if we actually achieve a lot without them. Uh, we don't realize that all we need now me and you. All we need now me and you for realize that dream. All we need now me and you for build our community. All we need now me and you uh, for for do what it, it requires uh, for for get our community to say we. Uh, you get for B. Your success now my success. My success now your success. If I feel and I de cry, it go hurt you. It go hurt you. The same way if you feel and you de cry, it go hurt me too. Uh, my boss, uh, my prince Agbo Gibet, very, very supportive uh, person. Always been there for Toridi. Always been there for me as a as an individual, as a person. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead now for invite the boss, Jeffrey. Uh, I think I think we are already ten minutes into the show. It's only it's only normal we get we get on with this. Uh but I know it's going to be a beautiful one. I know it's going to be a beautiful one. Now one of the best things that we it happened with me, I actually enjoy one and enjoy um now actually the backdoor comments. Uh wow. Thank thank you guys, thank you guys, thank you guys. Uh, now, actually, the backdoor comments that we it always come for to read the. When I say backdoor comments, I'm talking about reviews. I'm talking about people with their personal opinions about the segment will be get them. Um, I'm talking about people that suggestions about the segment will be get them. Um, uh, uh, um, trust me, um, it's wonderful. It gets it gets not like I did for that one place we. I don't see how our community they ready for support. I don't see how our community they put the effort for some more support in their little little way. And when I talk about our community, I'm talking about everyone. What are the lawyers? What are the doctors? What are the truck pushers? What are the the hawkers? What well, everyone is on board. But the problem I see most of them never see know how they get for support. So now when we put out projects like this, we put out videos like this, we invite some person like my brother Epule Jeff. Or my sister edit or, or boss uh 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 will give it or, or, or Sylvia or my brother boning when these people come on the platform and they share ideas they talk about what they're doing and they share ideas on how they expect support from the community or what they think the community is supposed to be doing guess what now for the way so many people they feel like oh so for me for support these guys it was this easy 
I be fi say na some very expensive thing. Na some two get for put plenty money or some two get for get for get for. No, no. It is very simple. It is very easy, and that is the reason for these conversations. That is the reason why we are having these talks, guys. Go ahead and share. If you just join, go ahead and share. Go ahead and share. I don't send link for my boss. I put a Jeffrey. I'm sure he did try for join now. Once you join, we will kickstart the conversation. Um, yeah. So that is it. Like we 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 at the ever talk say we not get mommy and papa. Um, my brother, my my my, I go give it. Boss, I go give it. Always. What would he talk? He would always tell me like, Sako, I understand your pain. I see what you do. I see how much you invest. In as much as I if you give you 100 million, and if you give you 200 million, and if you give you, I understand what you're doing brings happiness to you. You understand? And and continue for do that because that is the only way we will grow our community. We will not get mommy and papa. Look at me. I did do Kamif. Millions upon millions, so I invest for that project every year. You don't want to go look at how much sponsors they give me. You go cry, you go feel discouraged, but it makes me happy. It gives me joy to see our community come together, and we just, especially with the pain we don't go through for the the past how many years. When I say past how many years, I'm not even talking 2016. I'm talking for for a long a long time. You understand? So we there for that place we don't realize it, that only me and you fit do them for me and you. Now me, I feel support you. Now you feel support me. Now we go join support the other person. It no matter. People that character, people that whatever, whatever, we put them aside. Uh, we think positive. We encourage everyone for look one direction. So long as all man they look one direction, then we they on track. My brother, Pule Jeffy, don't join. Uh, I think so. We'll bring you in now and uh, we'll we kick start the conversation. <laughs> Boss. Hey. Yeah. Boss, 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 boss. Oh, boss. <laughs> Tata Masako. Finally, <laughs> when you called me Tata the other day, you need to understand how happy I was. <laughs> yeah. It, it came from nowhere, but I was like, wow, okay. I think, say, I really, really like this. Um, brotherhood. Brotherhood. Man. Yeah, wow. it's all brotherhood, my brother. <laughs> boss, boss, man, I'm happy to have you. By the way, for those who don't know, I don't troll this guy for more than 10 years. I don't write all kind of mint in them on Facebook about he. May he just give me some more attention. He the joker that's a title like I pass going. He the joker that's a t- <laughs> But guess what? He there for here today because I feel like he believes say which would the try for do is positive. Which would the try for build and go impact our community. Nobody level this. No be in level this. I ever tell people them, especially people like him when they come here, like maybe they let me the level, maybe they level this. No, no, no. Uh Tata. Yes. Uh, correction. Correction. This it'd be important for for make a rectification on which we to try for talk about no be my level this. Okay. Um to read they most likely not get the kind of traffic mm-hmm. where people maybe you want. There is mm-hmm. some of we you want, but mm-hmm. The rectification want to make and be and I say, you know, it Tori Day conveys, you know, the spirit of of persistence and consistency. Wow. And the fact say we, you 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 are you carry along a very positive message all the time, mm-hmm. not necessarily if you engage majority mm-hmm. of uh, which will be arrive around the internet these days. You know, controversiality sells. Yes. Negativity sells. So really has remained consistent. Even mm-hmm. when you the toxic sometimes used to throw me some of those mm-hmm. bits and all that, you know, it is it is it is all in the business. But I think you don't manage all through maybe six to seven years now for remain yes. yeah. for remain consistent on some particular positive kind of va- wave and vibe. Wow. Wow. We it it is difficult to engage a lot of people into this kind of conversation, conversation. positively. Yeah. But you know, looking at the caliber of people, the way they don't be on Tori Day, mm-hmm. you know, if we talk say no, no be my level this. And not young, they don't be here, Jews nya, they don't be here, Agbo Gibe, they don't be here, Agbo Pala don't be here. Nigerians, Zambians, yeah. they don't be yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. Ebanganjang them, Ebonki them. Yep. You, my guys, you maybe you never get Stanley and all Don Jazzy yet, but yep. you know, 
it is the movement it is positive and we cannot say we, we one one touch one person at a time one person very at true. a time we'll very get true. Very yeah true. Yeah, Plus, man, I, I'm glad it's coming from you. And for me, that's yeah. it. I just feel like, like I've been talking earlier before you join. We're not going with mommy and papa. We'll come over that place. We uh, no person no go do one for we now. Only me and you, now me and you, and the next person, now me and you, and the next person, and the next person will go put our time, resources, and everything together for make sure. See, uh, we if we do all, but if we do some small way, it will at least build the foundation where every other picking we can build. Upon more no hair, go for phone boss. Welcome again, and thank you very, very much. I, I want to use, use this opportunity to send a shout out to Abo Gilbert, Prince yeah. Abo Gilbert, the boat, the yeah. Prince of Inoku. You know, <laughs> yeah, you know, sometimes, eh, sometimes yeah. I don't, I, you know, I don't come out a lot publicly, yes, but when when you get the opportunity, you find forgive reverence and, um, mm -hmm. you know, celebration to. To people, they really they, they don't they don't be consistent in your path of um, in your path of which we you call them your your, your goals and things mm -hmm. like that. Abu yes. Gilbert has been one of the major pillars in my life in terms wow. of yeah. To he's like a brother. Yep. You know because I know how I give flowers and talking to my papa. Mm -hmm. He's going not too old, but yeah. Abu Gilbert has been very consistent from the time we. I meet up at Bob Gilbert when we when I did my first movie sometime in 2010, Real Destination. Yeah. Abu Gilbert go studio, go watch the raw footage, and then mm -hmm. meet up me somewhere around Bonamusadi in mm -hmm. Yaoundé, mm -hmm. Bonas. Yeah. Then he say, I recognize you. I come up for studio. I don't see you for some raw footage. Mm -hmm. You 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 get potential. Wow. He encouraged me. Mm -hmm. And 13 years after Abu mm -hmm. Gilbert is still play the same role. Wow! In my life, and um, to me now, one of the people that we need for always for me when I get the opportunity like now, I yeah. want to say thank you to Abo Gilbert for a lot of support, not only to the Cameroonian film industry or entertainment industry, but to people like us personally. Yeah, yeah. you have been massive. You know, a lot, a lot of narrative there around the guy where people know, people don't know. But to mm -hmm. me, yeah. on a personal note, yeah, Abo Gilbert is a human who is fallible. He makes his errors better. Yes. One thing I will tell the world mm -hmm. when about Gilbert do you wrong, mm -hmm. he goes 360 to make sure he corrects that. Oh, it's very true. Yeah. Very true. Yeah. Very so true. shout out to about Gilbert and um the world Cameroonians don't celebrate you too much. Me, I celebrate you every day. Wow. Yeah. I just wanted to take that small two guys, minutes for giving flowers. Guys, guys, <laughs> so when I feel imagine like this show is about him, it's about him. We're supposed to be talking about my boss Jeff, but then the first part of the show, now for first of all, acknowledge to we did the second part of the show already. Now for celebrate yeah. Abu Gibet. This tells you who he is. When I shared the flyer earlier today, uh, yesterday night and earlier today that you were coming on to read it, uh, it was positive, positive, but everyone was that oh, simple guy. Oh, the only negative thing they talk about you now say you can't talk plenty English, English, right? yeah. They say, I prepare myself. <laughs> say, I prepare my dictionary. <laughs> now, the only no, negative no, no. thing that, and, and I feel like we should thank you for that because um, that is what we need in our community, especially today. Especially today, we will get internet. We, most of the things that we are picking, they follow and for internet, they see them. We need people like yeah. you. We need more people yeah. like you for be out there. That way, we are picking, they get good examples for follow. Boss must start for the beginning. I know some few people no go know you, but definitely all my way for the life now so know you. But the people that you can watch later, maybe some one or two persons go be where you don't know you. Just tell us a little bit about you, your names, where you're from, and uh, what you do. Oh, it, it, yeah, pretty important, Mola. <laughs> Tata. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, same thing. Same thing, Mola, Tata. Yeah, same, thing, same thing, you know. The people people from the coast, I think they, they get that, um, you know, mm -hmm. but let me let me go back to the to the introduction which mm -hmm. is very important and um it, it brings me to the point where my introduction of it come in without actually you know conceding mm -hmm. to very strong points of how much cameroonians they only come back cameroonians mm -hmm. in particular yes. are beginning to come back and understand that and because again that conscious they want to get that consciousness around who they be yeah and who are you particularly always revolve around very few things, consistent yeah. things, yeah. what you eat. That's true. What you drink. Yeah. What you wear. Yeah. yeah. How you appreciate people. That is yeah. what makes you, your beliefs. Yeah. 
That is what makes you. Cameroonians are beginning to really get aware. So mm -hmm. you see some people, they now go probably come back to the live and they want to say, okay, now which other one this way they don't bring up? Mm -hmm. Well, I am a Pulage Jeffrey. Mm -hmm. I, I used to be, I want to use the word used because... Mm -hmm. Uh, no longer be much more uh, a little uh, no more, more like a lot implicated in film or acting anymore wow but i had a long stretch of a career in film and acting mm -hmm. um i'd say about 80 movies at the time i stopped counting wow yes um i had a license in public law from the university of yaoundé too wow but preceding that i went to schools in yaoundé Mm -hmm. Primary schools in Bamenda, mm -hmm. Boya, uh, secondary school in Boya mm -hmm. and Yaoundé. Yeah. And um, after that, after school, I think I decided to, at the time, I'd be really one for Bush, Bile Mola, Tata Nasako. <laughs> Say, hey, I go hit Bush, I go hit Bush. <laughs> and then I had the luck of meeting a certain neighbor Lawrence. Wow. And uh, Lawrence introduced me to some first project, Royal Destination. Mm -hmm. When I, when we did Royal Destination, to me, I didn't take it serious because I just say, ah, you know, Nafim. He be tell he what he told me was, you look nice, you talk very well. Mm -hmm. uh, there's this role I have in a movie. It's about some um, guy from America. You and that's how I got into that film. Mm. And I don't explain to you how but Gilbert go to the studio, watch that film, and then encourage me. Yes. Later on, I met Tanya Elvis the Daddies. I did another movie with um Richard Kings mm -hmm. and Sidney Sidney too. Yeah. And that's how that's how basically I fell in love with film. Wow. I did never intended to have a career as an actor. Mm -hmm. Neither did I intend to pursue law. Because mm -hmm. that's what I, I read. Yeah. Um, I had a license in that. I don't know what's the equivalent in English. Mm -hmm. But I come from, where do I come from? I come from a family, a background of journalists, of communicators. My oh. father, mm -hmm. late Pa Kome Epule, Kome mm -hmm. Epule Emmanuel, wow. was actually the first director of Radio Cameroon. And wow. actually the only English-speaking director of Radio Cameroon. Wow. Cumulatively, at a certain point in his career, he held the position of regional or was it provincial delegate of the Northwest and Southwest for information and culture mm -hmm. between 1972 mm -hmm. right up to 1984. Wow. So I have a lot of background in culture. And mm -hmm. I have a background in reading. Yeah. My One of my elder brothers is a journalist. Mm -hmm. One of my elder sisters is a journalist. Wow. Another one, an administrator. Wow. So I come from an environment where reading and trying to understand who you are came mm -hmm. naturally. Wow. During my school days in the 1999s, I used to be a dancer. So basically, like, nobody, right <laughs> <laughs> nobody will be there around Boya. <laughs> nobody know about April and Jeffrey, 1999s. Yeah. Like, I think one of the first uh, accolades that I ever win for my life, you've been as a dancer. Wow. And as a dancer, uh, most of the events, them, I remember so one time on Kubea, on Kubi now, mm -hmm. Bea Lena Bruce, Legend. we carry me go for some events. They call them business forum. It was very big back in the days and we began mm -hmm. to perform. Yes. And I fell in love with Bea's oratory, yeah. how he was talking. Yeah. And given the fact, say, I came from a background of journalism and communication, mm -hmm. I just yeah. loved on Kubea. And mm -hmm. the same criteria with this day, on Kubeya, with the camp visit most yeah. of the time when I was young. Grand so family when family I see Abiyata, <laughs> all right. <laughs> but he eventually married a small team. So okay. let people not get it treated. <laughs> it was the love of his life. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. You yeah. know, we just followed that small team for nothing. Yeah. They got married and now yeah. they, are, they, have, they have a very big family, four yeah. kids. Uh, family. I think so. Yeah. So. Yeah. So yeah, so that's how I fell in love with with hosting. Mm -hmm. So in between dancing at events, mm -hmm. I started doing a lot of hosting, wow. a lot of MC. Wow! I did that even when I was in school, when I was in the university, when I was in college. They'll call me for parties and all that, mm -hmm. and I'll host them. 
I started getting calls even from our host from Boya, right to Yaoundé, go to Kumba. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I made a I started earning a living very early from entertainment. Wow. So from like 1999 up to like 2010, I, mm -hmm. I've been already become accustomed to, to the entertainment scenery. Mm -hmm. So when I had the opportunity to do film by luck, mm -hmm. I was already bold enough and confident enough in my personality because one of the things that we will learn across this business mm -hmm. is to be very confident about yourself. It's what I tell mm -hmm. a lot of people, young people, mm -hmm. be confident about yourself, love what you do, believe mm -hmm. and the most important thing never make your mistakes when yeah. you're young yeah because now that mistake will define you how you'll go eventually hopefully we'll come to that so that's yeah. how i made a journey from dancing to emceeing mm -hmm. to acting and every other thing afterwards just followed so wow. principally in a in a in a not too long thing i hope i haven't made talk no, more no, than no, no, um, no, no, boss, we are good. yeah that's that is a pull jeffrey Wow. That is a problem. You talked yes. about you talked about confidence. You think say that confidence actually start now when you start do your things in here and there, or now a continuation from which we the bill for you for house, or maybe parents, sisters, family, or friends, or maybe, like you don't you know, they already build or lay a foundation inside you, and then even when you get to the street, you just continue for grow and grow and grow. Um, first thing, mm -hmm. something about confidence is. Uh, most of the time it be innate like yes. it's just something within you and some mm -hmm. you need you need certain factors or push them may mm -hmm. come up but mm -hmm. I lost my mother Tawade. I lost my mother I think I was about 10 years old wow I was young and um, that in itself put me in a position where my brothers because my brothers I come I come from a my, my it was a polygamous home mm-hmm but my brothers were very united and we had one sister. Mm -hmm. She, I think a, I take a lot from a lot of the confidence we, some of we get today. Mm -hmm. We come from how they treat you from house. House, very true. Some of the insecurities that so a lot of people portray. Come and that on. is why you see most people today go talk to you, you need a certain presence in your life, a father figure, mother mm -hmm. figure and all that. Mm -hmm. You know, those things are important. Important. Wow. Yeah, you understand in building that innate feeling. But yeah. when you know get them, the process is longer, especially mm -hmm. when you start going to the streets. Wow. Because you get to learn, you have to learn a lot of things on your own to understand yeah. and believe on what you you understand, who yeah. you are. So yeah, most of the confidence I had was because first of all, I, I was very I I'm be more like a sponge. I just needed to, I wanted to always understand. I would read. Mm -hmm. I will always read mm -hmm. any book. I will take books to the toilet, my brother. Like mm -hmm. I will take novels to the toilet, even when I did, I, you know, wow. I want to read, I want to understand things, you know. Wow. So basically confidence in itself, when I came face to face with my first challenge in confidence was, I think about two years into my acting career, I met mm -hmm. a certain Jim Ike. Yeah. And to me, the first time I met Jim Ike was okay. All right, I don't meet all the guy. Mm -hmm. Now this fine boy, mm -hmm. highly rated Nigeria mm -hmm. superstar. He was Jim Ike. We get that kind of personality, yeah, my brother. When you meet him, you you start shaking. Yes. So, what put me to the test in terms of my confidence was was I've been associated with Cameroon Jim Ike. Mm -hmm. and all that and all that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when i saw him yes i realized it, okay this is i look like yeah. this brother yeah. yeah then i realized that there is more to this guy mm -hmm. this guy no be the guy is smart yes jim i literally go whole script he read them for mm -hmm. three minutes mm -hmm. he could tell you line by line wow of maybe 10 pages of that script just wow. without even checking it wow now for that i realized him Confidence is not only about um, being talented. Mm -hmm. It's about refining your art wow. and meeting the right people. Wow. If you are around the wrong people, let's say you do not meet the Neba Lawrences, you do not meet mm -hmm. the uh, Tanri, the Dadises, or the Agor Giberts, Giberts, yeah, or you do not meet uh, the Jim Ites, you will remain in that place where your talents be underexploited. Wow. And, you know, when you, are on, you feel underexploited, mm -hmm. There is something about your esteem. You start feeling low sure. about yourself. Yeah. 
Yeah. And th that brings me to a certain point, you know, it brings me to how Cameroonians are a reflection of that low self-esteem. Yeah. A lot of Cameroonians look at artists, mm -hmm. musicians, yeah. actors, particularly yeah. as mm -hmm. a reflection of what they could have been. Yeah. So they do not give them the full value of what these people they do. They do, yeah. To them, a certain Mr. Leo, mm -hmm. if he's singing, I could sing the same. Now, just same I never get that opportunity. Wow. And that's true. And that's true. I could, I feel play football. Now, say they never give me ball. Give me, yeah. <laughs> so I don't value that. The person that's playing. Um, a Pule Jeffrey, now that picture I've been knowing for support. For support. In the act with you. Mm -hmm. Now, say me, you know. Yep. So we are just a reflection of, a, and I don't know how that thing will happen. We will come up from that position. Mm -hmm. But once we start coming out from there and start really giving ourselves value, mm -hmm. we'll understand everybody be gifted in their own way and mm -hmm. will not arrive to where we did by mistake or by chance. Mm -hmm. We'll get to start giving our people their value, respect, and honor which we get them because no talent no come into a position where we did by chance. Wow. So, con con so considerably, we don't, we don't build a system of mediocrity an mm -hmm. ocean of mediocrity mm -hmm. where everybody is swimming inside. And because mm -hmm. there is no quality control system, mm -hmm. everybody feels I'm a musician. Everybody mm -hmm. feels I'm an actor. Okay. Everybody feels I'm a footballer. Everybody mm -hmm. can do anything. There is no quality control. Yeah. Therefore, a lot of non-quality don't be poured out. Mm -hmm. And the non-quality now get a struggle mm -hmm. for talents for be accepted. Wow. And when talent will be accepted, you get for come back now, start force people. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, you need for love. You follow know, Cameroon movies. Yeah. Follow Cameroon music. music. Why you know the follow Cameroon movie? Yeah. But because, simply because uh, initially, mm -hmm. we did not value which it be day in the system. There are a lot mm -hmm. of things that contribute to that, but, you know, yeah, maybe <laughs> we'll talk about those. Yeah, of course. Uh, at the end of the day, if we don't finish the conversation today, we'll finish another day. The one thing we I don't, I don't. Now, you mentioned people I've had. You, do you know one of the first people I had on Turidi as interview when I see the Cameroon? Now, Reverend Yan Sakoninku. Wow. Yep. Amazing. Like, and then you know what was funny? Man, share this story. I went there, I, I reached out to him, got there, presented my project to him, and he was like, okay, this is a good project. I don't want you to do this only now. I don't get even Kanya Kwe when I see the Cameroon. He said, I want you to make sure you stay consistent with this. And it will get you, it will, it will build our community. Maybe even it will get you for some place. It will build our community. Sure. I go meet up at the bike back then. I will record with my phone and then come back and transcribe them, type them for Facebook, put a picture on my picture, and then type all one hour conversation for Facebook. Um, the first day I go, excitement, I kick, I start conversation. Only for me, for finish one hour conversation, I did for her, I did go, I want play, I want play this scene. You don't really record. record. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. So, I stand for that place. So, how you call the party? I don't waste your one hour. <laughs> speaking of Kanya Kwai, yes. speaking of Kanya Kwai, you know, yes. Kanya Kwai is another soldier. Mayor of, Kanya uh, Kwai. Mayor Kanya Kwai, with all, every respect. <laughs> every outdue respect, Papa. It would be, be a little bit uh, difficult for me for always relate to him as Monsieur the Mayor. Mayor. But yeah. The, it doesn't, like I said, those things don't come by mistake. Yes. Every person we don't, they for a position where they don't, you know, some is locked, some is not. Most of right? them put in the work. Mayor Kanya Kwai, mm -hmm. when he come back from the US, yes. the first project we be doing, we be at the African guest. Yes. He regrouped some of us at the time who were like, okay, like really passionate about film. Desmond mm -hmm. White, mm -hmm. um, Alene Menget, um, that's another legend. Mommy Queen, Mommy Queen. Um, uh, there's another Mami, Mami uh, uh, Magdalena Bo. Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, took us to one village in Boya and we shot the African guest. Mm -hmm. He already shoot the sequence for America. Mm -hmm. From there, Kanya Kwai go shoot Viri mm -hmm. with, with uh, Desmond White, Lino Lovett, Stephanie Tum. Mm -hmm. After he shoot Viri. He can do a collaboration with Anna Renoir and Bomb for Nightfall, mm -hmm. a script written initially by Carl Safinda. Mm -hmm. Carl Safinda, I don't go on to write A Man for the Weekend, Kuva, wow. Wow. 
um, and a panoply of other interesting Cameroonian top-notch movies, which mm -hmm. a lot of people don't know. But Carl Zafinda will be under the tutelage of a certain Kanye Kwari. Wow. Today, Carl Zafinda is one of the major screen players, then, but he was wow. really trained by Kanye Kwari. Kanye the film A Good Time to Divorce Will Win Alene Menget. Um, Best African Actor at the Golden Awards in Ghana, Ghana was yeah. written, produced, and directed by Kanye Kwai. Kanye Kwai, for sure. Initially, Kanye Kwai's this, uh, first choice to do that group character was uh, Richard Murphy Damijo. Mm -hmm. As a close friend of mine, Kanye always discusses his film things because Kanye is one person who will ask, he will ask, ask you about film, like he will have this conversation with you, like how I would talk now about yeah. the project. Mm -hmm. And he said, This is what I want. This is what I want. The way Kanye Kwabi don't write a good time to divorce. Mm -hmm. Mola Nasako. Even you, we just should only talk behind that microphone. It was mm -hmm. so well done that the moment I read them, you I tell Kanye, I say, You ever go perform this character? If he, if he just mellow himself down, get into character. Mm -hmm. Don't get a breakthrough. Yeah. And that's how some of us, I don't mm -hmm. want to say I, mm -hmm. recommended let them get Alene Menget. Wow. And that's how Alene Menget got one of the best projects in his life. Mm -hmm. That film opened doors for Alene Menget. And mm -hmm. Kanyakwai went on to do Life Point after that. This time, from, from bringing the Nigerian from Nightfall, because for Nightfall, we brought in Clem Oameze. Mm hmm for life point, you go bring one of the biggest French actors, mm -hmm. Gerard Isumba. The yeah. bar is like, like the biggest French biggest. francophone actor. Wow. So that metissage, Kanye do always do. Mm -hmm. One of the most unsung film entrepreneurism for Cameroon is okay. Kanye Kwai. Very true. But Very true. his own people uplifted him because of the work he did. Yeah. You know. So this consciousness is, is, has begun to come. Although some people want to take um, a portion it to themselves, yes, but the consciousness is coming. Reflection mm -hmm. of those consciousness now, people that like Kanye Kwai, mm -hmm. and I know see a lot of more politicians will emerge from entertainment. Mm -hmm. I think somebody like Salatiel or mm -hmm. Stanley stands a good chance of being a senator or yeah. a mayor someday, or a wow. Gilbert who understands wow. the business Very of true. filmmaking. Very true. You know, uh, and this awareness around we will only push we to excel. You understand? Yeah. yeah. We must always take time. And that's why I love to read it because to read it celebrates. Mm -hmm. To read it, pick everybody the way they work for the film or music or fashion business sure. or yeah. whatever business we do, as long as you are relevant, no yeah. matter how small. small. Some, some of we are small, but to read the books, you go find me. Boss, and these things not, are important. Boss, not small, <laughs> some of these things are important because if we don't give ourselves this relevance, people yeah. are not going to be conscious. Very true. Very true. And that consciousness is important. And the, the simple reminder why when I listen, get, when you mention some of these names, I did go back to them now because yeah. they, now people we don't put in blood and sweat, and sweat and are incredible in the business. And they deserve to be celebrated. That's very true it, because, yeah. yeah. That's very true because Trust me, every time when I sleep, I look at what you guys are doing, the Kanye Kwe and all of this. Bro, I'm like, these, these guys are not celebrated. You understand? These guys are not celebrated. I mean, if you say I deserve to play for national team until I talk to a young and I realize the sacrifice with the guy be put her in when all will be there young. And then I'm like, no, 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 Sako, you never get no right for play for national team. And that is the same thing I see with what you guys are doing. You, when I don't put in so much, when I don't put in so much for Wewe, I don't get no choice before. Try to do my own small for even say, Papa, thank you for all we do when I don't do. And you know what's funny? All that name, the way don't call them, they get one thing in common. Very simple, very humble, very, very supportive. I'm telling you. Yeah. yeah. I'm telling you. Yeah. Like, yeah. Gabe, go just wake up some one day, just call me, say, Sako, wait till it happen. I say, hey, you say, okay, I want to say you $100, me, you go chop something. Gabe, you day, you day not come away, you just VC, not VC, like, you know, they see me like bush faller or I say they over sofa or you feel they side over. He said, No, I just feel like you're doing something good. Take the one hundred dollar or the go chop so small, fine team. You know, the same thing with Kanye Kwe. Ego Joe Record text me, says, Sako, I see what you do. Continue do them. I know it makes you happy, but continue do them because you know, say they help build our community. The same thing with you. I not struggle with you. 
I not struggle for get you for Tori day. But guess what? I'll, I'll, it was funny. It will sound some kind of way. But I don't talk to people the way they never even accumulate one one hundred of the work we don't do. Either the one might do this or do that or do that or do that before they come on to read it. And I'm there. I'm just like, yeah, okay. When I get them, I will do it with one time. And then you come on to read it. can share your story. So if you bless the next generation. Boss, I get the next question. When yeah, now? Please. When now? Most of you now. You feel the talk for Jesus of Memphis, you did 100 years. Now lie. You, Kanya, Kwe, Agbo, Gibet, all, una really, really young. But una don't, una don't study thing for that really. Una study thing for that. Una, you guys were really very young when una started this whole building this foundation. Now, one two I've been doing, I say back then, the temptation were, were crazy. Especially when small thing, they see you with Jim Ike, they see you with Agbo, Gibet, they see you una, they see una movies. How una be manage all of that? That stardom for that early age. How would I be the manager and for fee stay this consistent, continue for be humble and continue for impact our community positively the way I do today? That, that, that's, that's a nice one, but uh, I, 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 I like for be modest about the stardom aspect mm -hmm. and I like for be consistent, which we be actually override, you know, because when you mention the stardom, you, you hardly mention how we leave off. Which yes. we really do. Mm -hmm. Because um, I'd say from the movie what we do with uh, Van Vika, Decoded, yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe some year, I think that was 2011. It could be 2011, 2012. I don't remember mm -hmm. too well. I was paid, um, I remember how much I was paid. It was, I think it was 50,000 francs CFA. For one movie. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You get, and then you know a lot, a lot of things women don't go through. Like when we were doing the movie, initially, the person that we need for the movie was John Dumelo. Mm -hmm. So they contacted John Dumelo. John Dumelo accepted to come do the movie, and then I think in between he began another bigger project. Bigger project, so -called. yeah. Better. I don't want to assume what happened, but while we don't start filming the witty, he call off. Mm -hmm. So they send the script now to Mike Ezeroni. Mike Ezeroni mm -hmm. was on Vogue at the time. He too was very big. Mike yeah. Ezeroni read them, then say go get back to them. So while they were waiting for Mike Ezeroni, we were already filming. I would only go like four days, five days, just sitting like that. Maybe mm -hmm. one day we'll just go do one pickup scene or something like that. Mm -hmm. So they eventually send the script to Van Vika. Van Vika read the script, then say he liked the script, but some particular character, they will really overdo him. For some particular film, then yes. So he liked some other character he could like for player, and that was the character I was casted for. Wow! So we had already been filming like maybe eight to ten scenes of that. In be in between, I had to change and switch and do now the other character initially preferred for Van Vika. Yes. So that I did that switch for fifty k to to us. What I which I try to talk now, see mm -hmm. to us it wasn't about the money or the stardom. Wow. Uh, to me, each project was, I used it to learn. Yeah. When I did, when I worked with Van Vika, I'd become a little bit of Van Vika. That's true. I would take something from Van Vika. Mm -hmm. When I work with Anna Rinwanenbaum or mm -hmm. Chief of Valerie mm -hmm. or Libota McDonald mm -hmm. or Godwill, Neba. Mm -hmm. There is one Cameroonian actor who is so underrated. God will never, I want to. Wow. That guy, that guy ranks on my top three actors in the world. Mm -hmm. Nobody saying at any team. We are sleeping on that talent. Yeah. Just like I thought, one of the reasons that I left the Cameroon film industry was because I felt at a certain point... Oh, did you say you left already? You don't have to talk about Amelie Sandra. Why I left yeah. acting? Why <laughs> I left, maybe we'll come to that. Maybe we'll come to that. But what I try to talk and I say, in essence, we, we were more passionate yeah. and enthusiastic yeah. and wanted to learn yeah. Than the perks of being with girls and every if a girl came, that was a bonus, my brother. Mm -hmm. If we could have a drink somewhere for free, mm -hmm. that was the bonus. Then to me, I don't I cannot speak about a lot of other people, yeah. Yeah. but I feel like it was much more of the passion than mm -hmm. anything. I remember how many times I met a person like Jovi for Hotel Residence Carlos, and we were like really cool friends mm -hmm. before the world turned Jovi to the monster where he became yes. Jovi Le yeah. Yeah, Jovi was accessible and all that, but the constant bashing, 
are you comparing mm -hmm. Jovic? Jovic had to transform. Not everybody can deal with Very that. True. A Very lot true. of Cameroonian artists and actors don't resign in their spirit. Mm -hmm. They don't want to do movie again anymore. Not because they don't like them, mm -hmm. but because they are doing it now uh, out of they have to eat. But before it was for passion. Yeah. So why would we stay away or we we mix the the stardoms in quotes and mm -hmm. the girls? and the mm -hmm. parties in quotes, mm -hmm. but still stay at top was because we were passionate, we were hungry to prove a point to the world. Wow. Yeah. Boss, yeah. boss, you you don't mention twice. First time you talk I mean, Lissano, yeah, you talk I again mean, the second time. I want to talk something now. The one thing we don't want or the one thing we would struggle for do for the platform now for make sure see if tomorrow there is no Kanya Kwe, we should have a Kanya Kwe already in place to replace him. If yeah. tomorrow there is no Apule Jeffrey, we should have an Apule Jeffrey already in place to replace him. If tomorrow there is not Stephanie Toom or um, uh, my sister, the other beautiful woman, Bayangi, Cindy Emade, or, or, or my she's, sister, Ayo. She's a corset. Cindy is a corset. Okay. Stephanie Toom is from home. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, or my sister, Ayoko, like, what what is Apule Jeffrey doing to make sure? Okay, if you finally retire, like you said, we will get the next Apule Jeffrey ready to run with your with with your um your legacy. Wow, that's a, that's a deep one, eh, my brother. But um, I think we should look at it from this perspective. Mm -hmm. We don't want another Apule Jeffrey. Okay, right. Yes, we would want would want would want another act, a Cameroonian actor. Okay. Would want another Cameroonian face. Wow. You understand? Yeah. Yes. Because when you look and say you want another Ipule Jeffrey, mm -hmm. that's limiting ourselves and limiting us, limiting Very me. True. Very true. Yeah. So me, I look at it more like we we want another actor. Why did I? A lot of factors wow. made me take 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 away myself from the screen mm -hmm. because. Let me tell you something, my brother. I have a colleague of mine who is still in the industry today. We're not enemies. We're good friends. Mm -hmm. But this lady walked to me, met me somewhere. I was sitting with Pa Otia Vitalis, who is a Cameroonian actor, one of the only few Cameroonian actors who might have a couple of movies more than I do. Mm -hmm. Otia Vitalis, another okay. film giant. Wow. Met me, Otia Vitalis and Kanye Kwai sitting on a table, and this lady walks up. In mid-conversation, he tell me, Ipule Jeffrey, if I see you in one other movie, I go vomit, I go puke. Those were her words. I said, because you're all over the place. Whoa. You're all over the place. I said, oh, man. <laughs> I said, you don't bat for that level. <laughs> and now you get a few other Cameroonians then, you know, because our movies used to circulate only within a particular crowd. Yeah. You know, we didn't reach out to a lot of people. That's why, you know, our sales became very diminished um especially when we face the transition from analog to digital digital yeah there was a a, a down downfall a downfall in in our marketability mm -hmm. so a lot of we used to just know these movies between ourselves and all that at a certain point yeah and these few people who kept watching and because like i I'm earlier mentioned to you mm -hmm. most of the people who want who are really criticizing us are people who wanted to be actors but did not have the opportunity? Very they true. kept telling me to my face or sending you read comments and all those things. They will tell you, Masa, Cameroon get only one face. Cameroon get only this, this. Then I said, okay, let me let me conduct a social experiment. Mm -hmm. Let me take myself off for a while. For a while, and then I realized nobody was really missing me. And I said, hey, maybe it's true. And mm -hmm. when I left, the Cameroonian industry began even started doing better. Better. Wow. And I said, okay. Maybe some of us were the impediment, you know? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I said, no, you know, it's better. It's, sometimes it's not just about you. Mm -hmm. It's about letting you understand. Now, brings back the question, what, what, have I, what have I done to ensure that we have other... Or what are you uh, doing? Or what am I doing? You know, okay. That is why I got principally attached to the Cameroon International Film Festival. Okay. Kamif. I wasn't in the position to be... Um, whole master classes and all that but i i volunteered to be part of the cameroon international film festival because uh, that's why you see sometimes my films will get nominated or mm -hmm. run on the this thing mm -hmm. but i'll not 
I'll not be in competition. I will not win a, a category. Yeah. Because it will be a bias okay. to others. Okay. But to me, it was important that festivals like Kami hold the mm -hmm. master classes teach and when when i when i got the opportunity of working with younger actors i will mentor a lot of people okay the the guy i'll i'll, I'll quote a little example mm -hmm. he might not acknowledge it today somebody like montana peters mm -hmm. they are they are all people i have talked to mm -hmm. one way or the other and pushed today mm -hmm. they are the new generation wow um the loved lambes who is now of copies oh, yeah um the Yannick Dominuses. Mm -hmm. I've had fallouts with actors because sometimes you cannot stand you cannot stand the sometimes the gap between me and other Cameroonian actors is too wide, it's intimidating. Mm -hmm. I've had colleagues who do not want me to be in a position to actually mentor. So challenges are there, but I've been helping a few people. I don't want to name names, you know, but I've called a few names. Mm -hmm. um, Prince OJ's mm -hmm. uh, guy. The list is long of people that have been under my wing and that will not say it today, mm -hmm. but they are a direct result of what I've impacted. They are present today in the field, they work as actors, mm -hmm. and I know if they are honest to themselves, they would say the truth someday. Mm -hmm. I don't want any reverence. Mm -hmm. You understand? I don't want any flowers, mm -hmm. but they know. No, but boss, and trust yeah. me, when I ask these questions, it, it's not really about them acknowledging. I know. Or I know. I'm just saying. I'm just giving I'm you, just, yeah, I'm giving I'm, you palpable examples. Palpable yeah, examples. Which, which, yes. is, which is very, very important because at the end of the day, you know one thing I don't notice for our community? Our people sit and ask questions and they don't even go look for the answers. So for instance, so Manfi Joshi don't even think about it, put the Jeffrey right. And he just asked her like, he don't even do it. Since we said we don't support you. He don't, and then he could just shoot on for that play, ask all that question there. Yeah. And then jump into his own conclusion and then just yeah. start hating Pule Jeffrey. But yeah. I know True. you very well, even before we had this True. interview, not not today, it starts from the first yeah, time. Yeah, you know, yeah. when, when Bandy Kiki started what he started, you did a, yeah. uh, an interview on Bandy Kiki or you did something with some project with her on her, on her blog. That was I think when so. I, I actually did I did my research on you that time. That was how many years ago? More than seven yeah. years ago. So yeah, oh, I know the work you don't put in. I know the work with people like you, Agbo Gibe, the Kanyakwe, and all the rest that put in. When I ask the question now, because I want to speak with people understand, see, these guys are not just here for themselves. These guys are here for themselves and the community. More about the community. And they do yeah, it. because Until you I, I totally get you, but you know, sometimes when you when you go and you start talking about okay, are be they involved in this um master class, mm -hmm. uh are they involved in the boot camp for training actors, it's not really palpable. Yep, you know, so some people want physical, mm -hmm. uh, you know, like ah na me I do so, na me I do so. Mm -hmm. So why I mention those names is because they are alive, mm -hmm. they are verifiable, mm -hmm. and they can talk about it. You understand? Oh, people yeah. you have, you don't know, like people, if I know they today, I'll be sure say, okay, if you want a Cameroonian actor, I can guarantee you that you can make this call and they'll be on a film set. Oh. Now, how they got to this place psychologically, emotionally, and professionally, is not oh. too important. Cameroonians don't want to know that. Of course. But what I'm trying to, I'm trying to point a finger at physical and palpable examples. You understand? To go, going back, going back to, what what we what I've been doing is you know like most of the time mm -hmm. I remember there's a movie I there's a movie that's my story I have I had the honor of meeting a producer mm -hmm. and eventually this movie was titled Silent Storm. Yes, it was my story. I worked extremely hard. I had between me and between me and the producer we held about forty meetings. Wow, just to get that project together. Mm -hmm. But at the last moment, when they brought in the director, the director told the producer he doesn't like my presence on the around. My presence would be a problem on the movie. Are you kidding? So <laughs> I think I think yeah. So what happened is they they got I I had to leave my place, even though it was a movie dear to me. I created most of the. It was one of the best projects that had to happen 
in terms wow. of finance, in terms of story and every other thing. That was two years ago. Wow. So when the director said that, I don't want to call his name. He's a very mm -hmm. popular director in Cameroon. He's a god. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, but I think what happened is readily, when I pulled out of the project, there were ready people able to fill in my shoes without any problem. Bro, I like this. And those are... Wow. Yeah, so those, to me, those are, those are achievements. You wow. understand? Wow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, but, but I'm telling you, like... You know, maybe you don't know, but now about the third time this way, you're actually seeing something like that. You had a project that you were supposed to work on, you shifted, and someone else came and they did it correctly. Now, very few people go acknowledge them. And the mentality yes. for you it, now, because of your mentality now, even if not be me, the next man made the next man do one fine. Sure, even, even if, and, sure. and that's the reason why you already have a, we should say a legacy. This, uh, now my next question is, boss, you're a legend. Now, oh really? Uh, no, 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 no. And also, you want to deny or whatever because now on that, I want to tell you, say na legend. He say I ah, no be legend. Kanya kwe I no be legend. This man I no be legend. Oh, man, but this is it, right? Legend how the, the, legend. No, no, no. the number of movies, the journey, the consistency. You understand? The work when I don't put them in. If we talk about the foundation today, now na. No yeah. man if he dispute her. If we talk about the foundation today, now, I know. By the way, any person will understand how we like the work, you know, even get a dispute her because there's supposed to be a foundation and you can come in and play your own role. Maybe you raise the building or you conclude the building or, or whatever. Bro, you're a legend. My next question now, um, when they mention all these other new names, um, the likes of, uh, what is this guy? The guy from Ghana. Um, uh, Beth, you know the new names that they exist now. Uh, even the, the guy from Ghana. Yes, um, uh, God, it, this is very disrespectful for me to forget his name. Oh, is it? We, are you talking about Quintus? Can Quintus? Thank God, I remember before you. <laughs> oh my brother! Hey, <laughs> that quick is so correction. That quick is so correction. Yes, I know. But let me, let me, let me, let me jump into that real quick. Quintus. Kinox K Q yeah. is not yeah. a he's not a new he's not a newbie. Are you kidding me? No, Quintus is not a newbie. Wow. In one of the pictures I sent to you, yes, in, there's a picture with me, Chief of Valerie. I'm in a blue. Uh, that's not a suit. It's something the teller tried to make in those days. Yes. And Chief is in an. Oh, is a uh, cream white thing. Uh, yeah. I think Quintus is in a red shirt and a blue blue thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. that was at the Cameroon Movie Merit Award sometime in 2012. Wow. Uh, I think I won Best Actor for the for the movie Decoded. Mm -hmm. Chifo went Best Supporting Actor for something, and Cam Quintus won. I think Best Short Film for his movie Rage or Are you something kidding like me? that. Yeah. So in 2012. Yeah. Yeah, so Kinoske, Kinoske, it's um he's he's an example of perseverance. Kinoske, wow. if some now somebody we don't you don't learn the art of metamorpho metamorphic, mm -hmm. like morphing rather morphing morphing. Yeah, he adapts. Kinoske, to me, now the new generation, he encompasses the old generation and the new generation new because generation. he he knows what didn't work. Yeah, and he's using what works for the new generation. Wow, and he has the means. Wow, Kankwitus has been there for long. Wow, he's a soldier, my brother. Wow, he's a soldier. He's not a wow. newbie. Wow, I like not at I all. Like, I like I like not how you all. point that out because guess what? Some of you will not know, will not get knowledge, will not get depth about this industry. We feel like he's <laughs> new. Sometimes even when yeah. he, he, he when he do certain things, them would he feel like oh the new the new cat the one disrespect the older people this but no, guess no, no, what no, no. it's coming from a place of love and respect and I know the mistakes they will make them but then we'll get to correct them. Yeah. I really like the way where you point out this boss. I want to ask you this next question where some person just texts me now personally. My yeah. Me, do you feel right, like, because, because we we've had some really good projects uh where they even did for Netflix. You understand? But, yeah. Um, one thing will be expected that many people like you be for that project. Do you feel like 
most of our I don't know if I should say produce, executive producers or producer. I don't know who the, who who they decide who will play in the movie. Do you feel like some of them they not use persons like you because they either underrate you or it was just a way of disrespecting you or it was just a way of saying oh no we'll go bring somebody be better. It's a combination of all of the things you mentioned and more. Wow. <laughs> you understand? Wow. But not in any particular order. Mm -hmm. uh, the more will come from the fact that the things you haven't mentioned about that is because uh, I've not had the luck either. Because while you're doing these things, you need luck. You take Samuel Eto used to play with a certain uh, You remember Django? Oh, yeah, I know Django. Django. No, I know Django yeah. for, eh, who no, no Django? You yourself used to be a, a masterly footballer, you know. Oh. But I think you just get the humility for admitting, you know, you know. So it takes there's there's a little bit of luck in the whole thing. But mm -hmm. so it's a, it's a combination of all those things. Mm -hmm. But to my case, and that's why uh, I, I I try to be very humble about it and not be bitter. Mm -hmm. And those were one of the reasons why I said at a certain point, you know what, my brother. Maybe, you know, this is time for you to really just step back and reevaluate. It's not wrong to, to reevaluate. Yeah. Because, you know, you know, in as much as you need that luck and maybe you get the barest minimum talent, mm -hmm. you need help from other people. Very true. And when that help is not forthcoming, <laughs> you, you deal with it. So, yes, um, sometimes a few people we want to prove to the world that you're not good enough. Wow. A few people will want to disrespect you. Mm -hmm. And a few people will just want to just say, you know what? Yeah, you're not good enough. You know, and you should be able to take that, swallow it, and evolve. Wow. Uh, sometimes evolving means coming back better. Mm -hmm. Evolving means quitting. Or evolving means trying to fight. Wow. Uh, I, guess, I guess some of my family don't tell me so one time, say, guy, you ask, why are you so low? Like, you know, understand why I be so, like the, the statement the lady used was, I was an underachiever because I don't fight. Wow. Yes. Yeah, so it's something personal. And the other factor way I want me to consider, uh, mm -hmm. Tata, Sometime in 2016. When you call me Tata, they were masking this with me. <laughs> no, you're my Tata. You're my Tata. <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't know. Like, it is just with me. Boss, go ahead. Sorry for the distraction. It's all right. It's all right. Sometime in 2016, I was diagnosed with a with a serious heart condition. I really wish we did not talk about this. God. You understand. So I've been battling with that, and it is not easy. The field is very competitive. Your name is a Pule Jeffrey. When they want come for Cameroon, the first name they want to use Ramsinoa or Einan Nigwe or Jim Ike to compete with is a Pule Jeffrey. When they start doing that and you have a condition, where girls they want them, may you get six pack. <laughs> girls they want them, may you drive this kind of moto, fans yeah. or rather, you yeah. know, and you have a heart condition that doesn't give you the energy to really want to be yourself. From like 2016, and I think that's why I want to maybe consider the other part of which we producers will probably see and maybe I did not have the right energy in their movies and all that, but it affected me greatly. Wow. So it affected my performance, my availability and stuff and stuff. So while I give while I give some of those, you know, factors as a point of, you understand, I should be able, able to, to, to consider I have part of the blame. Yeah. You understand? So I think from 2016 till about 2021, it was challenging for me to be optimal. The responsibility was a little too much. Wow. And I'm not one of those people who come and fake it, my brother. I would take it as it is and try to work on it. If I know if it do, I'm... Mm -hmm. You understand? In this yeah. world, you have fighters, you have people who evolve, and then mm -hmm. you have people who just sit back. Yeah. So I think history will choose which one I was. And I'm confident, and I'm I'm really comfortable with whichever one history chooses to give to me. <laughs> Bro, yeah. you're, a le you're a legend. Trust me, you don't already you don't already lay the footprints. You don't already do what you if you do. 
you don't already build the foundation. You don't already do way to expect from so many other people, especially yeah. with politicians, because they, they don't feel we, I don't know. I don't want to even go there. But people like you, uh, especially, man, so person like me, I know what it takes. The resources, if they pay you 50,000 for a whole movie project, like wait you for we do that 15, like it's it's crazy, but then on a on a continue for be consistent, continue for push. Well, let me shock like you how, how we use the fifty thousand, my brother. It's easier okay. because when they give you fifty K, yes. it's not like they give you fifty thousand cash. Fifty K for one movie, on mention the, and maybe we hear back on the spot. They will not give you that fifty thousand on the spot, they will give you like twenty five or twenty thousand advance. Yes. <laughs> In that movie, you're playing the lead character. In the movie Decoded, my character was a superstar Cameroonian actor. We don't yeah. make them big, either on billboards, either on different kind of things. Yeah. You get for costume that character. You get for look like that character. Damn. The shoes. The way they pay 50000 The pants. <laughs> the shirts. The suits. Oh it's from your pocket. Wow. So the, the your, your foreign... Uh, uh, interlocutor comes and they go, Oh, you'll see stylists and fashion, all those people where they get yes. those clothes, they'll be rushing after them to dress them. Yeah, and you are just looking at the thing like, Let me shock you, let me give you another shocking detail. When we did the movie Decoded, it was premiering in Douala at um Douala Bessie. Yes, Douala Bessie is a 5,000 seater hall. That night of the premiere of the, premiere of the movie Decoded. Mm -hmm. They were six thousand to seven thousand people in that hall. Wow! <laughs> I came to the premiere on a bike. Or, or, I climbed Okada. Okada, call because Okada. They, because we say bike, they learn, so Yes, they be forget me for hotel. So I began to take bike. Me and Chief of Valerie, <laughs> we take bike to Douala Bessie. We'll reach like 50 meters to the to the place because on Benin Corner just day before Dwala Base, we'll stop there, then we'll walk into the hall. Like so now come up on a moto. So when we walk into the hall and they don't watch the movie, that's when everybody was like, Hey, see Cameron, not Cameron and that now he pull a Jeffrey. No, said tell really yeah, Don Jumper was on the red carpet when I came. Yeah. That's another Don't Joker did not push the mic on me like in, you know he did not. So when the movie ended, he said he wanted to do me an interview. I said politely no. I went, took my bike back to that same hotel, mm -hmm. changed for the wild party, came back on a bike. But that night, the Ghanaian actor had three cars. Wow. In his convoy, all of three cars to his availability. Wow. So those are the things we've been through. Those are the challenges, you know. I could name you more and more of them, but more just go. Maybe when I remember, I would tell you. <laughs> Boss. Yeah. You just talked about you jumping from one bike to another to do what you yeah. want to do for our community. I know it's passion. I know it's you trying to build something. I know it's you trying to establish something for the picking that will come after we. Uh, yeah. But then you still talk also about the Ghanaian or the person we come from outside. Uh, the actually, man, it's your cruise. Now it make the yeah. choice of which guy one use and all of that. Do you think that is the reason why we have this group of people who are actually pushing the whole eighty twenty idea today in a very very radical way? Uh, you you not know blame whoever decide for push the own thing for the way we choose you mm -hmm. understand yes the only thing where you feel blame her now how you push her okay i don't get problem with whoever they push the concept 80 20. Mm -hmm. the only time i don't get problem with 80 20. Mm -hmm. now when you start attack actors mm -hmm. he went out clearly he said, if they put Cameroonian actor for my 17, mm -hmm. no person no will know the Cameroonian actor. Mm -hmm. I grew up in Boya. Yes. My 17 is my base. Bro, I grew up in Kumba. I know you very, very well. You understand? So when mm -hmm. you start attacking that kind of thing, mm -hmm. and then I get people that like Prince OJ, them, Yannick Dominos, mm -hmm. 
mm-hmm. uh, Lobet Lambedem, mm-hmm. Peter Montanas, mm-hmm. all them they did look up to me, China Basile them, which you want to make this small actor they think. To me, that was the line. Mm-hmm. As long as you push it without insulting other people, mm-hmm. I don't mind. Mm-hmm. Now, how you push them without insulting is a challenge to the person. Yeah. Because enough people push away no insult. Yeah. I don't know how that even makes sense to some people. Mm-hmm. So to me, 80 20. You're doing 80 20 on to read it, my brother. That's what's yeah, de- definitely. And 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 that is the thing I yeah. keep telling people like we all don't do 80 20 and no community. You no, know, the I was talking with a Nigerian friend, bro. That that guy in a millionaire for America is doing a lot for the community, and he actually watched the session where I was supposed to have them um, CY on the show, the 80 20 guy, and he laughed. He tell me, say, tell their brother, say, which way the travel do make sense. But then when you push, when you carry the whole idea public, it, 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 it's really, really bad. It's more destructive than, than you even think. Because guess what? You're actually telling the world it's us against you. Now, the question where you get for Asuka now, how many billionaires do we have? Do you understand? For our country. How Tata, many? yes, Tata, yes. I like I like how you always approach very sensitive issues. Yes, you understand. Yes, let us let us. This 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 thing where you talk about be very important, and yes. I, I, I want to highlight them um, because I get the opportunity right now to talk about. Do, do do that, bro. So let us come back to certain things. Mm-hmm. Um, why eighty twenty? Mm-hmm. Right. No way, no day. We if you ask why, mm-hmm. we're not aware. Very true. You understand? So context. I don't tell you. I don't give you a background of where I come from. My mm-hmm. father used to be. My father retired in 1995 mm-hmm. as the uh, provincial delegate for culture. Yes. In the southwest uh, for information and culture. In the mm-hmm. southwest province, the the stockpile of literature and history we my pa get up mm-hmm. about Cameroon culture mm-hmm. or Anglophone culture. Culture. He, my pa na, he, he was a library that people did not tap in. Wow! But I had the the honor because my I, my father died in my hands. Wow! There's a yeah. lot of things I learned. That, that, that's that's. You understand? Mm-hmm. My father wrote a book which is called The Challenge of Responsibility. Yes. He wrote that book in 1988. That was where the principal dichotomy of the issues on our cultural identity, he tackled them head on. Okay. The challenge of responsibility for Cameroonians or English speaking Cameroonians themselves. Yes. For start understand who they be. Wow. Based on the facts, see, they come from a historical precedence where he come with Nigeria, Germany, Cameroon, French Cameroon, and all that and all that. There was mm-hmm. a lot of historical precedence that diluted, wanted to dilute the, 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 the Cameroonian people as a, a people. Yes. So the challenge of responsibility was for us to have that civic civility. Mm-hmm. That civic responsibility to understand who we were. Yeah. That is why in 1990, when my pa, the director of radio, yeah. then as a punitive, as a punitive measure to he, because if he start push for an identity for Cameroonians or especially Anglophone Cameroonians, then yeah. they transfer as provincial delegate of culture to Northwest. <laughs> we'll be there for five years. Yes. A lot of things in the way my pa be showing me. My pa be the goal for video club then for Bamenda, for mm-hmm. Northwest region. The mm-hmm. lock video club there, they will show white man film there. We'll be get all kind of cassette there for our house. Wow. And when my papa go for those video clubs, he will go, he will go divide Guasen Gwangwa, their, 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 their stage play them, made it, made video clubs and push them for so say, If you don't want to push them, you lock your video club. Wow. 
1990, Mapabi don't start propagate the concept of cultural identity and pushing Anglophone Cameroon values. Wow. There's no bigger 80-20 than that. Very true. Very true. You understand? Yeah. Each and every person we don't be party point now for that movement from that time till now don't be a major player of the 8020. I will give the do the first film before the sunrise. Yes. With how they call this uh, Nigerian. I don't call, I don't forget the the, the Nigerian. Mm -hmm. But you had Ivan Name, Goretti Echu Egbe, and yeah. Jean Pierre Esume. Yes. Why they bring them inside? Because he began to do that metissage yes. between the foreign Africa and Cameroonian identity of French and English. Yes. Gilbert never, ever, never, ever at one point, no ever be a party and a major fighter of the 8020. Very true. He went on to do something battle. How they call that film in, in, uh, in Barfoot with Jim Ike? Yes, and a host of other Cameroonian actors in Bamenda. Serious cultural movie. Very true. That was after before the sunrise. I did that film the really escape my. You understand? These are people who yeah. have implicated their resources in the fight to. If Gilbert dies today, mm -hmm. you will watch before the sunrise. You will watch that uh, film in Bafut. You and will the see message, Cameroon. And the message is there. Very true. The message is there. Yeah. When me and you will know day to day, we will watch this video and they would remind Cameroonians. Now, mm -hmm. the challenge of responsibility and the irony about the 8020 Nasim, we became so lost. Mm -hmm. And we want to blame Nigeria or Congo or whoever. Mm -hmm. Then because now our irresponsibility, we as a people, yes, make and we lost in the fight for who would be nobody else how do you grow up in a in a, in a small village like um Mbonge, mm -hmm. and you are so unaware of your surrounding we so take so much say some person get for remind you see the sing for dwala oh wow. how do you grow up and be so unaware wow you grow up now earphones tata did somebody have to remind you how to love Music. No. When you fell in love with music, you decide I'll start here the one. I'll start here the one. The one will find me. The yeah. one will find me. Then you want to know who sing the one. Th that is how you become aware. You want to know what you're dressing. Now who saw this thing? The how do people? I know you understand how human being them, Cameroonians them. They they grow so aloof and never ever understand, especially Anglophone Cameroonians, how they grow so disconnected. How they become so irresponsible. So much so that they did put up a badge of 8020. The talk say some person, if not be this person, I know forever, ever know Cameroonian music. I know forever guy, Mr. Leo and Salatia, they start for Boya for 2010. Very true. How unaware you began for be for 13 years of your life. When I for 2023, some person began for remind you. So you began wow. for no unfazeri. Wow. You understand? Very true, it is, it is, we need the revival. And that's where it is important for whoever is propagating the 8020 to come in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the revival must not go with insults. Yeah. And that's the problem. You don't need to come tell me today, say, I'll be stupid. I'll be dull. Mm -hmm. Because me, I'll be much more aware of my surrounding than whoever they propagate 8020. Wow. The shame is on you, who you don't know. Yeah. The shame not be not on you, Tata. That's the irony. Yeah. And anybody where you can talk to will not understand 8020. We don't understand 8020 like 20 years ago. 20 more than more than bro. I, I did for America. I call this this thing what they do to read it. You know, ring for your head. Guy, you know, ring for you your head. I call it at the three day. All my way come for you. Everybody who hope you you talk English, bro. Now, one hour, te, almost 30 minutes, you would only talk a pigeon. You know, ring for your head. Say, would you, would you, would you talk about push national ideology? Like, 
Bro, man, I'm just glad the way you put them. I'm glad the way you put them. There is a movie we did in in uh, somewhere around up, Virgin Blade. Yeah. That movie is shot entirely in pigeon. That movie win best film for Yara Film Festival. I win best actor for that film. Cinema, they win best actress. Actress. It is in complete pigeon. Pigeon. Kanye Kwai, a movie director, and with Stephanie Tum. Produce some saving bang. Yeah. Complete PG. Wow. Samba, the series where they talk about a Cameroonian fashion designer his story. Yeah. Everything we wear for that movie was designed in Cameroon between Limbe and Duwana. Wow. Every set thing with the designer for that film in terms of structure was designed in Limbe and Duwana. Produced by Elon Brenda, directed by Anna John Scott. Wow. The Fisherman's Diary is in PG. Very true. It's on Netflix. Alene Menget, he returned to Batibo. Melange of English and PG. Classic movie. Classic. How Classic. we do be for that position where we did for almost 13 years where people they can type today for social media. If no be... I know forever no Cameroonian. Uh, you are 30 of you're pushing 40. You get for be ashamed. Very true. You get for take the lesson way, whoever they give you, swallow and with shame, then decide for hold in honor the country. We don't give you everything. If not, you have nothing to contribute to the movement. Very true. Not be we get for be the, the, the victims. Not be we who will fight, be the victim. The real victim, and why they are giving them a voice is because they are using the insult thrown on the actors, yeah. artists, designers. Because Cameroonians like when they dodge from the shame, mm -hmm. then they give them to other person. Oh, to another they, person. Are, they, they are comfortable with the insults because it is diving away from them. Very the shame is on you where you don't know about your music. It's the shame is on you where you don't know about your cinema. Wow. The shame will be now. Wow, boss. Yeah, my brother Carol Malik. Uh, he just say, um, uh, see why amplify eighty twenty make with thanks. See why, bro. I want, I want point on thing. It's not like we are against see why you don't decide to put a name to whatever we were saying. It's not that we are, we are against see why. We just tell see why. See, be very careful with your movement. Don't be disrespectful to the people that do one for more than thirty years. Because if you know if you even acknowledge say, some people that don't do one. Then there is a problem. If you know if you, uh, you, if you know if you even acknowledge it, some people they actually support you in what you're doing, then there is a problem. It's not always about you. This is my opinion, though. Name now my boss a Jeffrey your opinion. My opinion, I see with him. It takes everyone for we for have these conversations, for we for for, for deciding, you know what, this is what we want, and this is how we can go about it. But the one thing we the one mistake we no one make them. Now, for step on tools, especially those tools we now then we invest in what we are doing, now then we put money, now then we help we get to where we want to get because hey, we won't win a war. So, at the end of the day, they will celebrate now a specific person. You know, tata. Whatever happened. Yeah, tata. tata. Yes, boss. There is a certain Gelam Dixon somewhere in Tiko. Between Tiko and Gelam, Gelam and the big they call you colonel, but to the industry, they call you godfather. Yeah, I know you very well. Godfather don't run modeling agency for the camera. 90% mm -hmm. of the movies, the way they will ever be shot between Southwest and Northwest. Mm -hmm. Godfather don't support them. Wow. Godfather don't do cultural festival. They call them CAF. Cameroon Arts and Witty Festival. CAF. Yes, yes. Godfather don't do so on if he if he intend for do some awards, though it fell off later in the road because of what disorganization. Mm -hmm. Godfather now one of the biggest proponents of the 8020. Very true. But you will never mention it because to him, 8020 and to some of us, 8020 way, you know even get for talker. Yes. Same thing I was saying the other day, right? act. When you didn't normal, when your yeah. brain they fun, yeah. When they burn you with every part of your sense, the function. Yes. 
it just be normal for you for toxic. Hey, I, do, I want go Moliko today. I want go Shaq. Boy, uh, give me Twantua. You drink Twantua now because na Cameroonian beer. Oh, yeah. I want yeah, they don't put music, they don't put music. You say, hey, massa, that my penny freeway salatiera music, you know. On a plan for me. In it, it is in it. Very true. It is in it. Now some people they don't even get for the 80, 20, na 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 na, na very bad thing. Mm -hmm. Na very bad thing. So you look for shelter. Yep. Very true. It let nepotism, it let tribalism. Very true. Very true. Very true. Very true. You don't do an underground, but you do one. You need to do a whole ha. Yep. Yep. Very you, true. You understand? Where you want favor, so you're picking. You know the shisha, the picking. You need know shisha. You don't put it out there. You understand? That's that's where I have a dichotomy in the whole 80-20 movement. Wow. And my dichotomy not just starts based on that fact only. Yeah. But on how... Where the person where he started is supper. You know, ma, the word you sup is to to where you sup something. That means you can't meet us until you own them, like say it was never ever there. It is almost parasitic. Very true. The foundation of that movement, the way they be built, was built, and I'll talk them again, and I don't always repeat them. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you how whoever who is pushing this thing decided to use it. Wow. Senior pastor, the comedian, yeah. began doing shows. He, senior pastor being a that kind of comedian, when he entered your occasion, placed the tear. Very true. But he wasn't satisfied. I don't know whether that because he get Nigeria spirit. I don't understand because Igbo people, <laughs> these Nigeria people have a spirit where they are, they want to break, they want to, they are never comfortable. Yeah, senior pastor is restless. He's a good Nigerian. He did do it in. Mm -hmm. You had at the same time a certain old boy, the comic, who yes. for some reason had almost the same restless spirit. Yes, but did not want to go the Nigerian way. Yeah, he was more. I will break the doors in Cameroon. Wow, and he met a certain CY. Mm -hmm. CY became senior pastors major opposition. Yeah. So when senior pastor started bringing his shows to Cameroon and bringing in those Nigerians, they really don't go make a contact because the boy no skin to hell. Yeah. You see, senior pastor and Abogibet. Yeah. They never born the best way the chook skin reached them. Oh, I'm telling you. <laughs> that two boy, they feel move card. They feel move person card. Yeah. Inside pocket, just so for instance, where the person lock out key, they will see move and call move the up. person saying, Where I, I need your card. So, when senior pastor started bringing these Nigerians, it was more like you are not giving a platform for the other Cameroonian comedians. Yes, it was a good platform because, yes, see why I had a point. Mm -hmm. You know, if you bring a uh, foreigner, then now then they control everything and all that. Yes, you understand. Then we Cameroonians will do how it became a bitter rivalry between those two. Very true. It was extremely bitter. They know the city yourself. Let me and I'll say it today and I'll say it very clearly. They do not see eyeball to eyeball. eyeball. Wow. Everything the media has the way the media has put senior pastor is to ridicule CY. When see why tell you say that they attack in mental health now because they use senior pastor insulty. Okay. And then he comes back to us who are not involved in the matter and and, 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 and punches at us. <laughs> the real person we have a punch at now senior pastor. Senior pastor. And the media has to find a way to resolve that problem and using that thing to attack CY's mental health in quotes. Not, not very bad I think, thing. I think I don't reach out to I'll say it here, I don't reach out to senior pastor. Unfortunately, when I reach out to him to have him on the show, be really be busy for Nigeria to do it. Thing. And he, he will come. Will, yeah, he will, he will come. come. He's a very open guy. So let me very, continue. Yeah. Tata. So when these things that go out of hand, that comparison between them two and that competition and that it became a big fight. 
Yeah. That's when CY started having problems with Nigerians. Wow. This movement started as a movement against Nigerians. Very it did not come from a place of love. Even me, sir, I feel, I feel so. It did not come from a place of love. My second problem with the issue was when Easter user but disengage with every other person where we don't work for the interest of pushing Cameroon. Yeah. It was, now me do this, now me do this. Now, let me come back to uh, other issues where they talk about um, you don't move past we and all that, and we know we're not good enough, and we, we don't, you know, guy, uh, it's, it's laughable. When in the system of things, in the system of how things that they operate, yes, no one human being no be indispensable. Very true. I don't come out of movie industry for two years. Nobody misses me. They will shoot the movie this evening. They have to shoot it. Yep. Yep. He is not indispensable. Whether I day or not day, we will do film. Whether I not day or not day, Salatia go sing. Stanley Eno go knock the Pari Paru remix. Yep. Whether I day or not day, Rinui, no fi change the voice. The yep. Pekin is gifted. That's Whether I day or not day, Libyanka go win a word. Libyanka go win Grammy. <laughs> Whether I day or not day, and until, until, some of we will do accept like how accept say he plays day because he get for remind. That other people where they don't know who side they did. They, yeah. Because now he plays they. Mm -hmm. He needs to remind that other people, not be we. We are not the problem. If yeah. we're poor because we don't make money from film, it is not our fault. It's not because we, you or me lack the talent. Very true. If art is not sell records today, not be now because he no servicing. Very true. You understand? So he's playing his part. We are playing our part. Yeah. He is not indispensable. Now, normal human being. Way to the decide come life. Hala, pass all man. Yeah. Not be everybody get that time for come life. Hala. Very, 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 very true. And uh, for those who they yeah. what, I want to point out something. We are not here to disrespect CY. We are just, we all which will the travel do now for just draw the line between. Wait till you the tribe do and wait till we the tribe for do. We all uh, at one point in time I feel like we all I got, I got a question though. I got a question. Why it be why it be um not, it be, could they be comfortable see why disrespecting other people and they're not be comfortable other people disrespecting you? But she asked me that question or the ask another no the person way the he the wounded. I know they see the people in the comments, so yeah, and that is very, very true. And that is the only one now. The only one place that we all get problem with which we see why they do. Number one, don't pick a country and go after them. Wait for some time, it be make a make look like against Nigeria. Now it don't slow one down, you understand. Number two, don't pick individuals in the country and try to force them to do what you want. You understand? If you have a dream, if you have a project, if you have whatever you want to do, bro, run with it. You understand? No man of the against which you want to do them. But do them in a very respectful in a re I want to grab my boss. <laughs> do them in a very respectful way. You understand? Don't make up a way where it disrespect the next person and they, it even it even put them against our community. That is for you me. See, only, my only you word. see, you see somebody like Delhi Singer. Yes. Delhi Singer, I respect. See, if Delhi Singer be the lead 80-20, I've run go life the 500 times. Wow. You know why? No. The lady no for. The lady talks. Yes. The lady, if you if he hold you while you the vex now, yes. Instead of making you feel the same, be crazy while you the vex. Wow. And when you deal with something way corny like and sensitive like eighty twenty, because I don't tell like I tell eighty twenty in a corny matter. Now, it's not something we're going to shout. A very tricky matter. Yes. But all community don't practice them. Um, one time, one make them very loud. Yeah. So, you understand, Tata? Daily singer, wax day, 
any person will be respectful of human being them. Yes. We get values. Today, a lot of things have changed. People they change, internet they change, uh, people they come back to some part to Apaga, people they come back to Agbada, people they come back to old things. I know few yes. weeks more come back to values, yes, to good principles, to respect. And if we will come back to good behavior, and if we may come back to when we hold people that we call as our leaders, and we hold them to a certain standard. Yeah. Any man where he be insulting, any man where he no fish show composure, mm -hmm. any man where no be responsible in any man where one demean another person, yeah, no be leader. Very true. You understand? Very true. Yeah, BT. We won't come to a table where we want eat all of we. We will not come and eat on that table be just because they chop fine, play the dirty will chop. Very true. Boss. Let's not get it twisted. Yeah. That's why I see come back and say the joke is on. The joke is not on me and you, Tata. Very true. We are aware of which yep. will be, which will only be. Yep. And you're not stopping. Tomorrow you get you get live show, mm -hmm. maybe Sunday or Monday again another live show. Mm -hmm. You will still continue preaching and highlighting people, bringing people, showing people. Say this man is doing this, this man is doing this. Mm -hmm. How come not only we for Cameroon be so oblivious to our own context? Yeah. Yes, and we must go. Let, you know, Tata. Let's go back to something here, which is very important. Yes. Let us go back to how we got here and people have been oblivious to it. Yeah. The transition will be getting from analog to digital. It then like some people they be they lost in that period. So I think that's where the 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 problem really start with our identity. Yes. You understand? Yes. I remember some time we for watch TV for Boya or Kumba you begin to put pole then capture Malabo. I'm telling you, <laughs> we'll show you know, up to Malabo. <laughs> yeah, we'll get signal. And then all out of a sudden, you will get CDs. Very true. CDs, they come. Yeah. But remember, so the time we see the CDs, nobody stay up to five years. Very true. Technology transition become too quick, and we're not ready for it as Cameroonians. Just like how internet don't come, and we're still not ready for it. We're, not, we're still not ready. Because... The transition for technology will be living from analog to digital come and Cameroon has not be abandoned the, 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 the thing about CD. You understand? Yeah. Cameroon has been locked in a process where they never see come up from that place. That's where they lost it. And inside digital, that way CD become something become like they call a cable. Very true. Cable network come, cable was 2,000 francs. Abo Gilbert and a few other people like Chichi Bliss, mm. they don't talk about this transition a mm. number of times. Yeah. Although, you know, people don't listen to them because I think the uh, Gilbert and Chichi mm -hmm. and other people they like Jews near them, they be too yeah. sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Like I think when Gilbert or Chichi or Jews near they talk. Cameroonians, the other people, they that other people, the way they did that disconnect, they look they like, okay, you did remind me of Tim if you be so, I don't care what you say, I don't like it. I like that part. So I'm gonna connect with somebody who I see myself more with. Mm -hmm. So Mark, continue. When digital cable came and CD died, we were stuck in a period where what you see is what you become. What you eat is what you become. How you dress is what you become. Very Cable true. was free. So Cameroonians became African magic. Cameroonians became Big Brother Niger. Very true. Cameroonians became Channel O. Cameroonians became Choice. Wow. And before was system, the liberalization of audiovisual in Cameroon before mm -hmm. opened up to Canal de Equinox mm -hmm. STV. Mm -hmm. We don't already go too far inside the hypnotism. Yeah. So much so that there is a generation that was lost. So I blame it more on digitalization. Very true. That transition. Yeah. Because, it, and especially after digitalization come, 
internet to just jump in. Very true. So we're exposed to a varied nature of the world. We yeah. and we were not ready. We did not have content to fit in to that universe. Very true. Because we looked Sparkle then their own team, they say, okay, they want Nakumba I know, team. I know, I know Sparkle. <laughs> I know Sparkle. If I see Sparkle team for internet, now that Kumba, ah, they can yeah. team of it. Yeah. Now the one way you come up for that side, yeah. fine. That's how we got lost. We became irresponsible, unattached. That's how we lost our cultural identity. So basically, the blame is on these people where they decide for being lost because you choose which way you decide for sleep. Very true. Very true. I guess some were though, Dr. Sleep. Yeah. I guess some were though, Dr. Sleep, because I be love Dr. Sleep music. Very true. Plenty of the generation don't know Dr. Sleep. Very true. I be the dance because I love dancing and I be feel use dancing as a tool. I be the sing for, I be, I be sing for cabaret, I be the sing for choir. Mm -hmm. Before I become actor, wow! Because I've been here for hone myself. Who side these people? They day where they question. Who side will be there when they will do all the thing there? Yeah. Who the joke they on? When I don't even play me in Takati, them say you know we play football, love and so we really want no even a two or German guitar. Yeah. Them say that if you look super mega, you know be concerned for understand who super mega. Them say wrestling to you not just for look John Cena. Yeah. yeah. How will be see the divide is not just it's not just on in Nigerian level. Yeah. It's a global thing. Now yeah. So, so the solution. Mm -hmm. I, I was gonna ask solution, you that. The solution be ambiguous because the solution lie right within the problem, and because we're in denial of the problem. Part of the denial of the problem now because we just start for user insults Nasako mm -hmm. today. Nasako get platform. I know if you watch Nasako platform, I'll go watch Nedu mm -hmm. because it is Cameroonian. Now, Cameroonian person, you know, if you give me two, I want that because to, mm -hmm. we don't already put up our mind, say, you know, fine. We and already know Nasako. Yeah, you understand. Yeah, we already we know the full of one camera. <laughs> yeah, we already know since if they might know asking for Nigeria come back like four times. We know validating. We know validating. I don't go, I don't do four films on Nigeria, my brother. Yep, I know. I was proposed to remain in Nigeria. Wow. It is no hidden secret in the film industry. Very true. I can't back quiet. I said, Nakoya go die. Blog the day for Nigeria, they be talks I'll be Nigerian. Yep. But I come me back. Money, there was money there. But when you come back and then you face the void, the disconnect with day for year, you see that some person will ask, I say, Stanley, you know, now who? It is sing witty. Guy, that boy sing head there. Even if you be disconnected, how? Yeah. Something. The solution, nah, forget the legislature. Mm -hmm. We need to push more of communion content on airwaves for place that we go from a free regulator. You know, if you don't know nothing about internet. Boss, my I cut you short. So my friend, sure. my very my very close friend, my very childhood friend, Carol Malik, uh, a guy, one guy we love our community, one guy we want to see our community grow and all of that. He just make a comment. He said, Nas, you agree with all thing we have um, uh, Jeffrey talk. Why? Maggie, Maggie, a reason why. Um, uh, Malik. Bro, now the first time we mean that Jeffrey did get a, an, a, a conversation. Man, if you say an open conversation, and the first time you mean you know, Jeffrey to get a conversation. But guess what? Me and he see beyond what we see why they try to do. No, guess what? He never talk for you say to see why they do wrong. He the only talk for you say maybe the method or the approach it, it be faulty a little bit. You understand? Me and you want to support our own. Me and you don't support our own. Me and you don't do everything for make sure say we empower our own. But is it fair for him to go around insulting people? Is it fair for him to go around disrespecting people? Is it fair for him to make it look like naive the first person we did one? That is disrespectful to the people like Papa. We don't do this in the 90s, in the 80s and the 90s. 
that is just what we are saying. This movement is not supposed to be about an individual. It's supposed to be about a community. It's supposed to be about we all come together and choose the best method or the best way. Where if we go about this whole thing, and then guess what? We achieve the goals that we want them. You know, they say they agree with the on everything they say. No, but everything they say, actually, which one they think, which one I do. My brother Malik, this is this, this thing is simple, right? My thing, for instance, I don't always tell you why. You can see why, even besides social media, we get our private conversations. I don't always tell you why. See, what you are doing is not bad. If we take the example of America, we had Martin Luther, we had Malcolm X. You understand? But you think that the family the way because of Malcolm X they were hurt. You think they'd be happy? They were not happy. So we really have to be careful with the way we go about voting. We want to see our people grow. We want to see our community get to that place where everyone is fine. And the mistake we want to make and our other people, there are other communities that goes in the way where they start a struggle for fight us. They start a struggle for you know what? I go, I go, I go, I go press to read them for down because I know if to read really grow, it go what empower my people. Globalization are the one who be all the exist. And we know what I like or not. Therefore, they are going to continue to exist. Bibian can just continue to come up with an award. Boss, is it the one? No, no, no. I listen to you. I actually listen to you. And I like I like to tell Karo Malik. I feel only interject. Yes. For when he talks, say, um, Nas, you agree with him the way Jeffrey talk. Why? Yes. All things with Jeffrey talk. Why? Because uh, Malik, I want to talk to you. I know so you did listen to me. It be dishonest. Mm -hmm. If me and me tell you Malik tomorrow, I don't know which way you do for life. And then I come into the place where you do, I start be all up like whatever you don't do, I'm no make sense. Wow. Everything you have done, no make sense. It's very true. You get for do and asu, do and asu. And then you continue to tell me, I continue to tell you again, say, whatever you do, if you not do and do way so, now so it will be, you will fail. You understand? And then you don't make me see reason. Mm -hmm. You understand? It is dictatorial, you impose and all that, and with the disrespect you don't initially can give me. Yeah. My initial response to you, Gobina for resist you. Very true. That is where. I don't know about others, but that's where I come from. Very true. Now, I'm going to go back to the second thing we'll talk about. Why the 80-20? Mm -hmm. The 8020 simply come as a result of the fact that people like Wuna, they be need for remind Wuna about Wuna Cameroonianness. Today, you call Musina Nasako by name. Musina Nasako. If you go for every place we are there, you will see a Pule Jeffrey, you will see. Yeah. They will get to call you Carol Malik. Mm -hmm. Because you'll be one of the people that will get for reminder. Sadly, <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> stay with the Cameroonian or you come up with one so please. But those are the, the job is on you, it is not on us. <laughs> you understand not Carol Malik. Bro, Take no, with no, 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 and no. respect. <laughs> yeah. Now the thing that that way we know like and that disrespect le hard don't disrespect you by calling you 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 understand that's so yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah that's it yeah yeah carol i hope so you understand i know so you understand what you talk my name is 80 20 more than that's more than 80 20 that's 100 100 in then i put a jeffy 80 20 100 100 Bro, we all day for support our own. We know what mediocre. I don't see some Mola for here. I don't see some yeah. Mola Mola Michael Jimia. If I'm yeah. for doing a shout out to Mola My Michael Jimia, that's my uncle in the US who is opening up a studio yeah. in partnership with Jungle Hop in Boya. Very true for video coverage, uh, events, rentals yeah. for video cinema. Yeah, he was at the Camif, he volunteered. To do the live coverages, audio and and video. and visual way on Abisha for Kamif. Yeah. That my uncle has been supporting the film industry for uh, close to 10 years today. Yeah. 
Wow. There was one time when he was walking with me to get me over to the US to come and do a movie, a couple of movies with a, a certain lady, Lamy Edie, yeah. maybe one of the main actresses there for a good time to divorce while learning men get. Very true. They are a lot of 80 20 soldiers. Very true. Time not, Sam, they took plenty and they disrespect me with the gear for the people where you can't make, let's say, they be in an oblivion. Like they be in a, like we'll be just a room in a hole because there's some of them now. Decide for no, no. Yeah. You understand? Malik, go back, think about them. Mm -hmm. First of all, go change your name. Who your real name? <laughs> Call your name, your 8020 Papa Biggie. You. Biggie. You. Because I'm sure your daddy and mommy love this country and gave you a nice name. Nice name. Which you don't want. Bro, but because you were watching too much they don't give me, magic. They don't give me that kind of name, them. <laughs> because you were watching too much African magic. <laughs> and you want to blame it now on the Nigerians why you don't know <laughs> Maligo kill me today but that's, that's the truth Maligo kill that's the truth my brother bro uh, <laughs> we are close to two hours and uh, I guess on Team for Duo Studio in, in, in 10 minutes what would you like our community to remember you for if you were not here today I know that you live at least 90 or 100 or 120 but if you were not yet today, what would you want our community to remember you for? Uh, the, the most important thing for me, yeah, for my community, that's that's a big ask. Yeah, <laughs> that's a big ask. But to the people who love me, who care, mm -hmm. I just want them to know me, love me as their brother. You know. Mm -hmm love me as their uncle yeah you know to the small brother them they know i'll be their big brother you know i i'm not a child of the world yeah i'm a i'm a friend wow. i'm an uncle i'm a dad i don't remember many times the propagate of 8020 don't cush some of we say we don't be parents <laughs> useless papa <laughs> Because we we'll decide for do movie there for fifty thousand because we we're yeah. trying to gain an experience. It is it is disrespectful and sad. I want my community to remember me for the sacrifices that I made in the industry. You did, bro. I want my community to remember us in an honorable way, not like Cabrel when he went. When I know it when it don't end all. When I know it when it don't end all. When I when I celebrate, when I know when they only cost me, Lux Lobe, Lux Lobe, I love, I love, I, that's another. Those are soldiers of the eighty twenty, my brother. Very, very true, very true. They're soldiers of the eighty twenty. You see, stick out name Lobe, whether yeah. you like her or not. Yeah. So, even the propagator of the team says, "Safe, no, they put in new name for side them." So, <laughs> faulty. You know, and um, those are the things we should be remembered for. Cameroonians, let us, especially Anglophone Cameroonians, let us go back to knowing, to being conscious. It is like we be under some opium. The real people, the way they, they take drug, now the people, the way they be unconscious of who they are. Very you are true. We are the ones who have been drugged. Very true. We need, we need for take a cold bath. And honestly, now for that, I give CY, please, because CY, the give. Some see of these people there will not be know who they be a cold yeah. bath. See, see why I please see why please day. Yes. Yeah. Because I need for remind Carol Malik them. Mm -hmm. Say hey, my gas could not sing turn by turn. Boy. I know but my gas always sung them from line lower. Mm -hmm. Because you me, I know my gasco, I don't need to like. Seven times Tony for pack for Bamenda who would struggle for do one or two kind of projects. Very true. You meet Stanley and not because they are not difficult to meet, but once you're implicated and you want to know, you will respect this, you will love these people. They don't need for be giant then. They don't need for be born boy. Very true. But because say, you love Cameroon or you love Anglophone Cameroon or whatever part you choose, it will come naturally. Very true. <laughs> It, it comes naturally. So how I want to be remembered is like like everybody else should be remembered. Let us remember all of us. No, remember, every, respect everybody in work. Wow. Not all that. Mm -hmm. Yes.
Bro, man, this is two hours of your time. I never even yeah. pay you for one minute of your time. It was beautiful, but one thing I, I want two things from you. Number one, now say because we're not really you can I say we only talk about the Apple industry, we don't talk about you. We actually okay. not, we actually did not celebrate you. So for that reason, we want you to promise us that you come back to the show when time they uh right. And then number two. Between Cindy and Made and uh, you, you talk about two person. One of the uh, the person we used to work with, uh, I don't know either Kanye or oh god, I've forgotten this name. But I'll text you the name when I remember. Um, you talk about that person. Why me, me tell you bring over to read it for we will continue this conversation with uh either Cindy and Made or Kanye Kwe or that person I will tell you after. Yeah, yeah, it would be good to. Uh, I know Cindy did not really like for coming too much on live shows. She doesn't share her spotlight, she doesn't like to share much. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so if you want to get real insight on, you know, somebody where I feel recommend mm -hmm. uh, for film industry, go look for Tebo JD or Chief of Valerie. So, yeah, I, I think I know the name Chief of Valerie. Can you talk to him and you, you can be the good for me? Because we are not big. That's the simple thing. In as much as you feel like we are big, but I feel like someone like you has to step in between uh step in between me and them and let us let them know what oh, we are okay. So who do you want to talk to? You want to talk to Stephanie Tom? Who do you want? Chief of Valerie. Okay. No disrespect to Stephanie Tom or, or, or Cindy, but I feel like Chief of Valerie, the name will be there again and again and again and again. I'll talk to I'll talk to Chief on your behalf. Bro, He'll be thank here. You, thank you very, very much, man. It was a wonderful yeah. session. And then the second part, Nabi, then I say, you say you come back to we for talk about you. The next thing we'll get of you will be not just about you. We'll talk about the movie. I had a lot that I, I actually prepared. Like my yeah. Maybe use my presentation. Anytime. Yeah. Anytime. Anytime at the house, to read in a house, to read in a my house, anytime. <laughs> Thank you, man. We need to have you back here so we can just talk about you and not no other person, no other, no, not any other thing, but just you. It's all right. Anytime. All right, man. Thank you very much. Any last words to our community, to our people? No, no, no. I think I don't talk well, you know. Um, if, if there's anything I want to say is for... Is for more be much more responsible and conscious. Yeah. More try not for be so we, we've become we have become so un unhappy. Mm -hmm. We are so unhappy. Why we it is it is reflecting how we talk to each other, how we accept each other. If we continue, so the real loss will be now we because would the intimidate would the intimidate the real picking they get for grow. The beautiful ones are not yet born. Very if you continue true. with the bitterness, you go worry. Let's let's be much more tolerant. Uh, and most importantly, my message now say the northwest southwest divide mm -hmm. is real. Let us not look ourselves as strangers, especially in the entertainment industry. When CY1 talk, they say, hey, come on. When Giba 1 talk, they say, hey, come on, Mayangi. Mm -hmm. You know, all we are brother them. And the moment we will start looking at the brother them, we will love what in the love our brother them. We know even the shout the palaver 8020 will keep us most more God, John know ourselves, John love ourselves. Mm -hmm. So one love always love, respect, tolerance, peace. Think before you talk, think before you type. See everybody as your brother. Throw me holy water. Free for each other, you know, love always. My girlfriend, love always. my girlfriend, he takes me. Stay. I know so small time you're not crying. <laughs> yeah, when he gets deep, when he gets passionate, that me. I, I, it's just love for the community, and I know that's the same thing for you. You love our community, you want to see our people succeed, see our people come yeah. together, uh, not before fight some people. Our strength together and actually carry with you we'll get into the war because that is where we want to get uh your sister Libyanka today. We don't win a war. You know, I, I don't I don't get any problem with the propagator of 8020 until he start attack my legacy. 
Very true. If he didn't go personal. Very true. You know, and 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 I'll be sorry for saying because it is wrong what I did. Because what I did was I had to wait for him to attack me yeah, before I could speak out. Speak. Wait, it means he did already attack other people. Yes. Yeah. You understand? He will not get for wait till he attack every other person, try for discard every other person, like everybody's petty, everybody in a toilet roll. I don't pass you know pass no man. Yeah. You know, pass no man. Very true. He's not talented at anybody. He's not bigger. Matter of fact, in the structure of the entertainment industry, he's a boss. 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 Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just want to one wake up the, the temperature a bit before we leave, you know. So <laughs> that was me just, you know, we could be CY, we could be a Pole Jeffrey, we could be Tata, we could be calm. We could be, you see, person, are you really calm and all that? You don't want to get to the other side, my brother. I know that. So people are telling me see from my last life, I got so aggressive with one guy who, I don't know, made one comment. And then I was like, I was like, no, not just these things, um, for we, when I look at like, the regular thing, but for we, passion is our community, is what we want yeah. to see happen. You understand? So because the other person they go the radical way, no reason we know about it. And we don't we don't have any problem with what he's doing on the field. He's starting like I like the way you talk about all we'll leave our made decisions with the other person and then get to with them we can react. No, we get to guide him from the man. Make sure that whatever he's doing is effective to himself and then every other person. Bro, boss. Uh, thank you very much. Man, we'll not talk bye bye like five times. <laughs> <laughs> this is and I, I, I don't I don't remember the last time I did it two hours, but this has been has, has been going for two hours. That is because bro. No, you know, don't worry, we'll do it again. We'll we'll my do it brother, again. I, I beg, I beg. Anytime I'll reach out. And I'll get you, I'll get you, get you cheap for, I'll get you cheap for, and uh, yeah. So yeah, we'll do it again, bro. Okay, man. Thank yeah. you very much. I'm the good you know. Clay, I don't know why. Uh, I guess so many people don't know what uh, my brother DJ is Uh, my brother Luke, uh, my brother, my no, what's my brother, my baby. Bro, let me make you fire me. <laughs> careful, careful, you gotta give bae place, so especially when you have been but uh, bro, so many people watch the ones that come in for still here for another 30 minutes, but it was a beautiful segment. Uh, Guys, let us go back. Not only not the move back for only like my brother, both the police, but uh, the many others they they don't lay the foundation. And they put emphasis on laying the foundation because most of the times when it's about the foundation, human is talk. Most people they only see now when they put the foundation. But guess what? Now that foundation could have built it. People like Apule Jeffrey, people like um, Agbo Gibet, people like you don't call so many names. Wait, wait till they do. Now those people actually lay the foundation of whatever we are enjoying today. Um, disclaimer, we will not be here for fight CY. We will not be here for fight any person where they propagate the 8320 movement. We are here to celebrate everyone. But would you just pray or would you just wish say me every other person do one for we we in it you hurt the next person. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I want to celebrate one person I beg. When I just bear with me some more. My sister, Ayok, uh, go to YouTube, follow him on uh, on YouTube. Go to uh, YouTube, just type Ayok on YouTube um, and listen to her song. She's doing wonderfully well. Uh, very beautiful artist, very talented artist, very humble person, very community-oriented person. We'll get another conversation. I don't know who the next guest be. But one thing is sure, we'll have a beautiful conversation and the goal now to build our community. If we fight, if we argue, if we do any kind of two or one do, you understand? But more don't forget, say, we'll get place, we'll come out, and we owe to that particular place the responsibility of building us. Go out there and follow my sister. Uh, that is my sister. Her name is Ayok. Her name is Ayok. Title of this song is Oka Kam Name. Listen to her songs. Follow her on YouTube. Follow her on social media. Let us continue to celebrate our own. Let us continue to celebrate the people who are doing things to, to put our community out there. My brother Lux Lobe, can we have you on Toride, please? Can we have you on the next show? Can we have you on Toride to talk about the beautiful things you're doing for our community? 
man it's not just me it's not just gibbet it's not just uh, uh, uh my boss i'm uh, a uh, uh, pulley jeffrey it's not just Mali. so many other people so many almost every cameroonian every person from our community what do meet up um, uh one for see our community grow want to see our community get to that place where we are all proud but how can we get there if we don't have these conversations that is what Toride is all about Toride is all about us having conversations that can build us listen to ayok and the beguna when i go for youtube go listen to her songs forget about this song listen to the next song listen to the other songs listen to, to many other songs from ayok and thank god for who we are we are just a people who come from this particular place and we have this particular culture and we have this particular way of looking at life we we'll definitely get to where we want to be thank you very much now this motor that we get on today Oh, I see me, oh, 